Elisha was a prophet to the people of Israel. One day, a man brought him 20 loaves of bread. Elisha told the man to give it to a crowd of a hundred men. The man was confused, but Elisha said, the Lord says there will be enough. So the man gave the bread to the crowd and everyone ate. They even had some left over. Another time, Elisha healed a man named Naaman of a serious skin disease. Naaman was the commander of the Syrian army. He had gone to the king of Israel to ask for healing. The king of Israel said, Am I God? Do I have the power to give life and take it away? Why does this man think that I can cure a skin disease? The king of Israel could not heal Naaman. The power to heal comes only from God. Elisha, the prophet, called Naaman to his house. Naaman stood at the door, ready to be healed, but Elisha didn't come to the door. Instead, he sent a message to Naaman. Go wash seven times in the Jordan River. When Naaman went to the Jordan River and dipped himself in the water seven times, his skin was healed. Yay! Naaman and all the people with him went to Elisha. I know that the God of Israel is the one true God, Naaman said. On another day, Elisha met with a group of prophets at the Jordan River. The prophets were cutting down trees by the river when an iron axe head fell into the water and sank. Elisha cut a stick and threw it into the water, and the iron floated back to the top. Elisha's miracles showed that he was a prophet of the one true God, and that God's words were true. In a greater way, Jesus' miracles show that he is the true Son of God.